example two of using the <clears throat> completing the square technique. We have the example y equals 2x squared minus 8x minus 10. You'll notice in this example, we have a leading coefficient in front of the x squared term. In this case, we want to first get rid of that value. So in order to do that, we're going to divide everything by that value. So we're dividing everything by 2. That helps to eliminate some problems when we're factoring, and it's just going to make the problem easier overall. So we have y divided by 2 equals x squared minus 4x minus 5. Next, again, we're going to get rid of this constant term. So we're going to add 5 to both sides of the equal marks. So we have y divided by 2 plus 5 equals x squared minus 4x. Now, over to the side, we're going to use our thinking caps to think of our process. We're taking the coefficient of the x term, negative 4. We're taking half of that, which is negative 2. We're going to take the negative 2 and square it, so we get 4. And so we're going to add 4 to both sides of our equation. So on the left side, our like terms, 4 and 5, we're going to combine. So y over 2 plus 4 and 5 gives us 9. And then we have x squared minus 4x plus 4. We're going to factor that trinomial. That's going to be x minus 2 squared. Just bringing down the left side. Now we're going to get the 9 back across, so we subtract 9 from both sides. y divided by 2 equals x minus 2 squared minus 9. We've got to get rid of this divided by 2, so we're going to go back through and multiply everything by 2. Remember to multiply everything. So we have y equals 2 times x minus 2 squared minus 18. So our vertex from this is going to be 2, negative 18. Our axis of symmetry is going to be x equals 2. Our shifting is going to be up. 2, excuse me, jumping ahead too quickly there, we're going to be going to the right two units, and we're going to be going down 18 units, and then where we're multiplying by 3, we're going to be stretching up towards the y-axis by 2 units. So don't forget that multiplying by 2 is going to have a stretching. So our vertex, 2, negative 18, axis of symmetry at x equals 2. We're going to be moving right at 2 units and down 18 with our stretch.